Hi, it's lunch time. So today I'm gonna to make a homemade pizza using the cauliflower pizza crust and some ingredients that I already have. I just took a red pepper out of the freezer. It's solid frozen. I freeze these and they last a long time. Um, tomato paste, jalapeno peppers, Kalamata olives, a little extra virgin olive oil, and some fat-free cheese. So I'm gonna get started. This is the cheese that I use, fat-free cheddar. Um, I just got this out of the freezer as well, so this is frozen. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is slice the pepper. It's very icy. Figure out how much I'm going to use. I was craving a little pizza, so I thought, hmm, eat a pizza for lunch. It's early, it's only 10.38, but I get up really early, so. Okay. Pepper is very cold and icy. That should be good. Next thing, that, I need to open the tomato paste. Not going to add water. I'm going to do something different today. Okay, I'm going to take some of the peppers, not all of them, but 
some of them. <clears throat> Not that many. Jalapeno juice and a little bit of jalapenos with it. I'm just making the sauce. Okay. And I will use this again and a little bit of the calamata olive juice. And a couple of other things. Italian seasoning. And all the way in the back. Garlic powder. And that's it, and I'm gonna mix this up now. I have to get something else out in a little black pepper as well. Okay. There's the sauce. I'm gonna grind that up. over there. Let me put this over here. Um, 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 um. that's defrosting. So let's get busy now putting this together. All right. Clean up some of this mess. All right, so I'm using this pan today, the one with the holes, so the crust gets crispy on the bottom. So here it is. I'm gonna start, let's move this over here. Okay, so here's the sauce that I just whipped up. It's a nice thick sauce. Um, Not using the olive oil because I was originally going to use a different pan, but I decided to use this one instead. Nice chunky sauce. Mm -hmm. 
nice thick sauce. Next thing we're going to do, some of these peppers. I have to get one more ingredient out before I forget. Get it out actually. Well, yeah, I should do it now. Let me get it. Uh, I'm going to use dehydrated onions because every time I buy onions, I forget about them and they always go bad. So I bought this big bag. The hydrated onions from Amazon a little while ago, and I just sprinkled these on top. Just white onion chopped up. This much. I love onion, so I'm gonna put a ton of it on here. That's good. Mm. Oh, so good. Next, okay. Um, let's do the cheese now. Finish this one off first. And I need to open the new pack as well. Put this out. First, I'm going to put some things down here before I add more cheese. Okay, let me get a fork out. Them around over here. Move them all around. I guess that's good. Next. Jalapenos. Get them on here and then I will shift them around. I'm going to sprinkle a little more cheese on the top. Open the new pack. This will be a very tasty lunch. And it should keep me full for a few hours. I hope so. Otherwise, I have to make a shake. Or some kind of a yummy drink. And I'll cook this at 400, probably about 
12 to 15 minutes, I'm guessing. All right, my hand is frozen, it feels like, because the cheese is frozen. Making a big mess over here. All right, so there it is. I'm gonna pop this into my toaster oven and I will be back. I added the leftover peppers on the top, so the toaster oven is preheating right now. I'll be back in about 12 to 15 minutes. Okay, I just got it out, it's right here. I have to scoop it out onto the tray. Okay, so here we go. Let's take it out. The bottom should be a little bit crispy since I put it on that pan. Here it is. <clears throat> I'm gonna slice it and taste it. So here it is. I didn't cook it for the full 12 minutes. Now this is a fat-free cheese so it's not going to melt as much as regular cheese because there's no fat, it's fat free. I put the parchment paper down so I don't have to wash this after. I'm gonna taste a piece. Looks delicious. Mmm. This one. I have my eye on this piece. I'm gonna take a big bite. Mmm. Very good. That's why I'm not talking. Mmm. So the um, cauliflower crust got nice and brown on the bottom because the pan has the holes in it. Mmm. Very good and very hot. Mmm. All right, well, you know what? I'm gonna sit down and eat this all of it and then I'm gonna go walk it all off. And then I'll be back later because I have some cleaning to do. Thanks for watching.